first question the tendency for increased litigation was visible after the introduction of land settlement system of lot convalis that is permanent system a zamindar system the reason for this is normal normally traced to which of the following provision answer is making making zamindar's position stronger vis a vis the riyat if you look at the zamindar system or permanent land revenue system the zamindar become the landlords of the entire zamindar right already the peasants were but here zamindars were made as a proprietor what make them is if a peasant refused to pay a tax that led to that zamindars forced to expel the peasants that was challenged that led to the so many litigation that led to so many litigations before the local courts that's why the first choice is the right making isna company an overlord of zamindar that's not at all making judicial system more uh, efficient no because judicial system though introduced it was not accessible to the people none of a b under the c that's also wrong the correct answer is making zamindar's position stronger vis a vis the riyat so this is a problematic things that led to illegal expulsion approach it uh, even you can see that the best example due to the zamindar's person is the pabna movement in the pabna movement when zamindar expelled the person illegally the best example is zamindar expelled the person illegally in pabna district the person approached the local court so they took it that took place in 1850s but much before that itself the problem erupted that's why first question answer a second question which of the following provided a common factor for tribal insurrection in india here if you look at that all seems to be the factor but question is very clear common factor for tribal insurrection so you can't specifically point out one or two why majority of the tribes revolted for the common reason what common reason made them for example the introduction of new system of land revenue and the taxation of tribal product one or two tribes tribal insurrection might have in the reason but not the per all and common point influence of foreign religion missionaries yes one or two tribal revolt because of that but not common factor rise of large number of money lenders yes that's also a reason but not correct thing is complete destruction of old agrarian orders of the tribal community this is that common reason almost it affected that's why it's not an agrarian dispute if you look at uh, that was the common reason for majority of the tribal insurrections mathe whether it's sandal so and so though we consider the cultural factor money lenders so and so they were alienated from hereditary land right old agrarian order and a new system was introduced that's why many a part when the economy was disturbed many a tribal people started to revolt especially dikadar ka uh, dikadar right uh, commonly called outsider these people were responsible that's why all seems to be the reason but most probable common factor is this so please understand the question it seems to be all are right which is and why because of this and third with reference to rayatwari system consider the following statement consider the following statement the rent was paid directly by the person to that yes rayatwari system no middleman rent was directly paid by the person the system was introduced in 1820 this rural basic in madras bombay kurg and part of assam the rent was directly paid the government gave pattas to that yes all the lands were measured and patta was issued so that in that the title deed was very clean the land were surveyed and assessed before tax yes that's what little bit all the lands were surveyed patta was issued and the assessment of land but the land rent was revised once in 15 year or 20 years these are all the other features of the rayatwari system so 
third question related to raidwari this is generally very easy to answer about that so third question answer is all c c is the answer all the statements next fourth question assessment of which of the which of the above was were introduced into india by Briti, by the english keep it in mind assessment of land revenue on the basis assessment of land revenue on the basis of nature of the soil and the quality of the crops this system was already there even in the akbar period itself uh, even sir shah period itself what happened is classification of land based on the fertility of the soil good medium bird if you come to akbar dodarmal system not only we classified the land based on quality of soil but also based on number of times it is cultivated thus nature of the soil and quality of crop system date back to medieval not introduced by british use of mobile gunners in warfare system is right from first battle of panipat it's a babar system introduced it so it was not introduced by british cultivation of tobacco and red chili red chili na commonly we used chilies that's it. that lengthy chili cultivation of tobacco and red chilies were introduced by portuguese portuguese because these two are uh, uh, this one is the south american crop right this is somewhere so cultivation of tobacco and red chilies by portuguese does none none is the answer fourth question answer d fifth which of the following was were associated with the introduction of raitwari raitwari system right is very easiest question in this elimination is kanwalis because kanwalis was associated with the permanent system because instead it should have come lord hasting lord hasting should have come that's why this statement is wrong a person is wrong alexander reed thomas munro are right and the answer is the c c is the answer is so one of the easiest question it's a very basic question fundamentals of understanding modern indian history sixth the staple commodities of export by the east india company from bengal in the middle of the 18th century so please go through this in the case of history second half of 18th century first half of 19th century it means at 1850s to 1750s to 1800s so you shall be very right so if you look at that 1750 here difference if you look at the raw cotton but here is the cotton got it if you look at that 1750 to 1850 for 1800s you can't see that much of industrialization so still they exported the finished cotton so raw cotton here this is a finished cotton product that's a textile that's the clarity right raw cotton after high industrialization 1800 onwards british started to export the raw cotton not cotton uh, product finished product that's why this is outrightly ruled out sugar salt zinc and lead lead not at all copper silver gold spice and these not at all these things right tea might have been but not that here probably is cotton silk salt bitter is a kno3 and opium this is the probable answer just to go through when they started to export raw cotton is 1800 onwards 1813 onwards when high industrialization gradually they stopped the textile finished commodity uh, sent from india seventh which of the following statement does not apply to the system of subsidiary alliance so does not apply introduced by wellesley keep it in mind many are subsidiary alliance introduced by british wellesley means many are thinking that wellesley was the first person to introduce subsidiary alliance no right before that dubley dubley introduced the system in india this is subsidiary system introduced by wellesley what is the main reason for introducing subsidiary system is 
to avoid napoleonic fear or because of napoleonic fear thus not applicable second statement is automatically ruled out because that is the main reason if you look at that it's a very interesting when wellesley was appointed as governor general in london at the and before coming to india at the time at the time itself warning what is the warning is wellesley be careful in india uh, in egypt already napoleon was in egypt he was doing success of italian campaign and he was in egypt be careful at any point of time napoleon may come to india right and may join with tipu sultan and may join with marathas marathas was not possible right may join with tipu sultan be careful so Nepo- wellesley was with cautious only he came to india that's why this is ruled out next to maintain a large standing army at the others expenses yes that is the right but the question is not this is also ruled out to secure a fixed income to establish a british paramountcy over the state that is also one of the cause of subsidy reliance so this is also ruled out so what is not applicable means answer to secure a fixed income to the company this is, is a permanent system or zamindari system this is zamindari system things that's why seventh question answer c question number 8 after the santal uprising subsidized what were the measures taken by the colonial government the territory called sandal bargana was created yes one of the main reason is uh, agrarian dispute along with that outsiders the outsiders were called diku commonly called so because of so many outsiders and things they consider cultural disturbances that's why what british did it after santal uprising they carried out bargana and so many restrictions yeah, it's very similar to inner line permit others should not entered similar things so right it became illegal for santal to transfer land to non santal even today there are land called panchami land if you look at the panchami land means panchami lands are land given to the scheduled people scheduled caste people cannot transfer such a land to non scheduled caste people it's like this restrictions are there so into this question answer is c both the statement as are, are right eighth question answer c ninth question which of the thing led to the introduction of english education so question is which led to the introduction of english education yes charter act 1813 is a humble beginning which provided 1 lakh rupees 1 lakh rupees for the promotion of education system in india but what is the tendency is what kind of education system to be followed that only controversy that controversy is called orientalist orientalist in favor of indian language system vernacular language anglicist in favor of english language system and general committee of public instruction what happened is here one lakh how to spend the one lakh whether to indian language system or whether to british uh, english language what kind of thing for that itself though one lakh was allotted for next 10 year the one lakh was not at all spent till the appointment of public uh, committee only headed by thomas mccalley that's a lord mccalley in that only 10 member committee in that 10 member committee headed by that in that committee only there is a split called orientalist group and the anglis anglican group or anglicist group finally thomas mccalley wrote an uh, minutes read right, education minutes based on the education minutes only that's famously called mccalley minutes based on that only english was introduced in 1835 so all our relevant information that led to the introduction of english education system that's question number 9 answer is uh, d delhi tenth question it seems to be easy but tricky sanskrit college not williamson paris wrong sanskrit college you know jonathan duncan william jones is related to 
ஏசியாட்டிக் சொசைட்டி ஆஃப் பெங்கால் ஃபர்ஸ்ட் பேர் ராங் கல்கத்தா மத்ராசா வாரணாசி கரெக்ட் போர்ட் வில்லியம்ஸ் காலேஜ் நார்மலி ஸ்டூடெண்ட் வில் கிரியேட் ப்ராப்ளம் வித் திஸ் ஆர்தர் வில்லஸ்லி ஆக்சுவலி ஆர்தர் வில்லஸ்லி வாஸ் நாட் கவர்னர் ஜெனரல் கவர்னர் இஸ் மார்கஸ் மார்கஸ் வில்லஸ்லி மார்கஸ் வில்லஸ்லி பிரதர் இஸ் ஆர்தர் வில்லஸ்லி ஸோ திஸ் பேர் இஸ் ஆல்சோ ராங் அமங் தட் ஆன்சர் இஸ் பி பாம்பே நெக்ஸ்ட் come to 11th question regarding woods dispatch so why woods dispatch you know, asked me it is considered to be the magna carta magna carta of english education system lot of recommendations were given and almost all the recommendations were uh, accepted by the government and implemented that's why it's called magna carta grants in aid system was introduced yes it introduced the grants in aid system establishments of universities based on that only madras bombay and kolkata universities english as a medium of instruction at all level this is wrong why this is wrong is english only in higher level why in the lower level lower level that is primary education wise mother tongue middle level wise vernacular english only in the university level that is the english hierarchy because of that so when all in every direction right whenever directions are given right nor uh, or and along with if these kinds of words are there in statement please read twice try to understand according to my civil service experience if such a question all direction in every direction mean 90% such a statement is wrong thus the third statement is wrong thus answer is a 1 and 2 uh, only next wellesley in established fort williams college right at calcutta here are yes fort williams college at calcutta that's what that's the same this is different here right for what purpose he was asked by board of directors at london to do so no actually he 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 didn't uh, even inform it to the uh, uh, board of uh, directors or court of directors even he didn't board of director or court of director even he didn't inform right that's why what happened is after the college was introduced in a few years later the college was closed that's a civil service college at fort williams was closed and a permanent college was opened at heliburi the first statement wrong he wanted to review the interest of oriental learning no way he wanted to provide william carey and his associated right that william carey joshua groups are uh, christian missionary, missionary groups they already were promoting the english education uh, western education system so it's wrong he wanted to train british civilians for administrative purpose this is right it's like administrative institution so 12th question answer d next come to 13th question which of the following statement correctly explain the impact so correctly explain the impact of industrial revolution in india during first half of the 19th century so this is all very famous 1800 earlier what is the thing is second half of the 18th century here is the first half of the 19th century correct yes what happened 1800 carefully look at that industrial revolution started in 1760s in britain 1760s to 1800 no major changes in india but 1800 onwards industrial revolution totally destroyed the indian uh, industries everywhere indian handicrafts were ruined this is the answer machines were introduced in indian textile during no complete our handicraft industries british had no interest to uh, introduce industrialization if industrialization was introduced competitor to the british railway lines were in many parts is wrong because if you look at that first half of the 19th century i mean 1800 to 1850 first uh, railway in 1853 not more than 50 kilometers so many parts of so if you carefully look at some of their automatically you can eliminate this 
heavy duties were imposed on the import of British manufacture. How is it possible? Light duty. Right. That's why this statement, this statement is, you can easily eliminate if you read that. So that's what here you can only thing on this, this is also you can easily eliminate. So that's why some question, if you read the question, don't panic. You just go through the question and carefully decode like this. Okay. Possible now? Try to write in pencil here. It's a 1800 to 1850s. No? Just to keep it or write it in pencil. So in that question paper itself. So that you will not get destroyed. You are, you are very easy to answer. Which of the 14 to question? Which of the following statement is a right regarding Brahma Samaj? It opposed idol. Yes, idol image worship, priest community. He denied the need of priestly glass. That's also right. It popularized the doctrine Vedas are infallible. These were the ideas of Arya Samaj. Brahma Samaj and Rajana Mohan Rai respected Vedas, but not necessarily a Brahmins to interpret it. Respected Vedas, but not infallible. Infallible means Vedas will never say wrong. That is called infallible. That's why this is wrong. Answer is one. Yes, 1 and 2, B, Bombay. Come to here, question number 15, Satya Sodak Samaj. Satya Sodak Samaj, also called Truth Seekers Association, was started by uh, Mahatma Jodhiba. Mahatma Jodhiba, it was an right, anti-caste movement in Maharashtra. Actually, it's a very straight and one of the easiest question in that UBSC previous answer. Yes, but 16th question, one of the toughest question in UPSC, Rakma Bai case in 1884. Really, we find it difficult, right? Very difficult, right? To ourselves to find the answer. But Rakma Bai was, uh, she was married at the age of 11 to one of the person called Bikachi. At that time, his age was, uh, his age was 19 or 20. Right. So, because of age difference and younger age, he, right, she didn't join with that husband. Husband also not interested of that. Actually, husband didn't interest. So, this Rakma Bai started to settle in her stepmother, foster mother, uh, yes, foster mother house. But what happened is, after the death of Rak uh, Rakma Bai's uh, parents, she received some property from the parents immediately. Because she wanted to join after long year, but Rakma Bai refused. At that time, she decided to go to school, educational institution, and became doctor. Became doctor. Again and again, her husband insisted for coming to the family life, but she refused. Immediately, her husband sent the uh, uh, vakil notice, vakil notice of conjugal restitution. Conjugal restitution means family life. So it is related to restitution of conjugal rights. Exactly. That was asked by husband. Right. What happened is the matter went to local court. Local court forced Rakma Bai uh, to uh, go to husband home. So and against it because of pressure. But what happened is Later, this matter went to Queen. Uh, I think she wrote the letter to the Queen, right? Because of using Queen's overpower, it's like a writ petition. Queen's overpower, right? That Queen nullified the local court verdict, right? And it thundered in that British level. That's why what happened is that led to the age of consent act in 1891, which considerably increased the marriageable age. Uh, to 14, uh, 14 years, 12 years to 14 years. Mm, 12 to 14 or 10 to 12? 10 to 12. Considerably increase the marriage age. So women's rights to gain, uh, right to gain education was no way included that. Thus answer 2 and 3, B, B is the answer.
Next, 17th question. Vital, vital Vithwansak. It's a Marathi word, I think so. Meaning is destroyer of Brahmanical idea. Brahmanicalism. Destroyer of rituals. Right? Rest, destroyer of Brahmanical rituals. The first monthly journal to have the untouchable people. For the people of untouchability, target audience right, was published by Gobal Baba Valankar. He was also from Mahar community. As like that of B.R. Ambedkar, he served in one of the local office. He was the first to be in such a local office, municipal office, corporation office, where almost other officials were uh, Brahmins. The Brahmin people opposed him. No, no, it is not allowed. He should not come to office. Opposed to that, right? At, then he started to work against the system and wrote this first monthly journal of this. Gopal Baba Valanga. 18th question. The Ilbert Bill controversy was related to yes, Ilbert Bill 1883. What's the Ilbert Bill says and controversy, contra Ilbert Bill 1883, Ilbert Bill controversy 1884. So keep it in mind. What's the Ilbert Bill in the judicial and especially in Sessions level? Sessions court, not High Court. In Sessions court, right, a yeah, Indian judge can also conduct a trial of the British. That's what. So imposition, removal of disqualification imposed on Indian magistrate with record to trial of the European. This is the right answer. That's called Hilbert Bill. It's a very famous thing. But what happened is British people opposed. British people opposed in uh, India. At last, the bill was diluted with some amendment. What is amendment means? If an Indian judge is... What is amendment? Keep it in mind. The bill was diluted. If an Indian judge was conducting trial, mean in the jury, 50% of the jury, jury means related to uh, uh, judicial, 50% of the jury shall be British. Then what's the purpose? Automatically influence. And one more thing is, not necessarily to be the Indian judge. Even a British judge also can conduct, if wishes possible means, British judge also conduct the trial. Then what is the purpose of introduction in bill? Bill was not withdrawn. Bill was diluted. Got it? At last, what happened? Against this controversy, only Lord Ripon, the then Viceroy, uh, resigned and left before his tenure. Next, 19 question. Again, it's little tough. Calcutta Unitarian Committee by Rajaram Mohan Rai. It is now the Bernacle of New Dispensation. It is an organization, Bharat. Like Brahma Samaj wise, Bharat was here Brahma Samaj, otherwise simpler Brahma Samaj of India. Rather than that, the vernacle of new dispensation, it's at Bharat Mandir. You just consider as a mandir. Next, Indian Reform Association. Yes, it was Kesar Chandrasan founded, associated with this. That's why Calcutta Unitarian Committee, not Rajara Mohadrai, then answer B. Two and three. Next, come to 20. First Factory Act was passed with a view to fix the industrial workers, yes, and allow workers to form trade union. Work trade union concept, no, always keep it in mind, only 1920s, especially after uh, Russian Industrial Revolution. Before that, no concept of trade union was discussed. Automatically, wrong. It related to fixed wages is also wrong. This is also wrong because first is related to children. First factory, first children. What's the thing? It fixed a working hour for children. It fixed a holiday for children. It fixed a, uh, it, it fixed age limit, age limit, minimum age limit seven. No children shall allow to work in industries below the age of seven. Thus, no wages of industries, no farm, absolutely wrong. Yaman Lokande was pioneer, yes. He was the first to start labor movement. What labor movement name is? Bombay 
मिल हैंड बॉम्बे मिल हैंड एसोसिएशन दिस इज एक्सपेक्टेड क्वेश्चन अगेन दिस दिस काइंड क्वेश्चन मे बी रीसरफेस्ड नेक्स्ट कम टू राधा कांत देव राधा कांत देव फर्स्ट प्रेसिडेंट ऑफ ब्रिटिश इंडिया एसोसिएशन इन 1850 हाउ द ब्रिटिश इंडिया एसोसिएशन मीन लैंड लॉर्ड्स लैंड लॉर्ड सोसाइटी प्लस ब्रिटिश इंडियन ईस्ट इंडिया एसोसिएशन ब्रिटिश ईस्ट इंडियन दीस टू नॉट ईस्ट इंडिया एसोसिएशन डोंट मिस इट अप विद राधा बेन औरजी दीस टू एसोसिएशन वे जॉइंट टुगेदर ब्रिटिश इंडिया एसोसिएशन गसलू लक्ष्मी नरसु शेटी फाउंडर ऑफ मेड्रास मगंज सभा रांग फाउंडर ऑफ मेड्रास नेटिव एसोसिएशन द फर्स्ट इज राइट सेकंड पैर इज रांग ही वाज अ फाउंडर ऑफ मेड्रास नेटिव एसोसिएशन बिकॉज़ मेड्रास मगंज सभा वाइज रिलेटेड टू जी सुब्रमण्य अय्यर वीर राघवाचारी आनंद चारलू सुरेंद्रनाथ बनर्जी फाउंडर ऑफ इंडियन एसोसिएशन दैट इज करेक्ट And the answer twenty one B Bombay is the answer. Next, to come to this. He wrote biography. Mazni Garibaldi. Mazni Garibaldi is a revolutionaries in Italian uh, integration. Shivaji Sri Krishna stayed in America. Nineteen or seven, he went to America and stayed there. And when he was in America, he started Home Rule League in America. Home Rule League, and he was also elected to Central Legislative Assembly as the member of Swaraj Party. As the member of Swaraj Party, so automatically, Modilal Nehru Swaraj Party, yeah, no, Bipin Chandra Bal retired. Arabindu Ghosh automatically retired in 1910 itself. After Sudesh Simon, these two people retired. Modilal Nehru, Pakka Congress man, so answer is Lala Lajpat Rai. So try to decode the question. Don't panic. Okay, if a question is little lengthy, first study once, cool, go through answer. Second study once, go through the choice. You will get it. Even after that, you couldn't. Na, don't keep on. Move on to next question. Because when you are going that, mind will stuck. Immediate, uh, you will come to there and answer for that in subsequent. Once or twice read it. Even after that, you couldn't decode the question and couldn't come come anything from this. Leave this. With reference to history, Ulugulan, Ulugulan means great tumult. Tumult, tumult means uh, revolt. Kalaga are the here great tumult is the description of which of the following Ulugulan movement is Bursa Munda. Even In that itself, himself can say Sing Pong. Sing Pong, their god name. Likewise, these are all the other terms you can come across it. Bursa Munda's uprising. Twenty fourth, with reference to home charge, what constitute home charge? Fund used to support India office in London. India office, no Secretary of State office. Fund used to pay salaries and pension of young age, young in India. Yes, for all governor general, everyone, whoever is working for exploitation of India, fund was given. And one fund, right? One more third of home charge is loan raised abroad and in Britain. So Britain and other countries for promotion of railways and shipping building in in India. That's also home charge. Fund used for waging war would not come under this. That's what home charge, na? In Brit London, what are all the charges? Need amount was given from in, given by India. That's why answer is two. Next, come to twenty-five. What was the purpose of William Adderburn, W. S. Kane had set up the Indian Parliamentary Committee? Actually, both are MP. Both are MP, right? So that's right. To agitate, to uh, to agitate Indian political reform in the House of Commons. Yes, actually, Vidya Madhavan was very important. He was already acted as a judge and worked as a secretary to Bombay Governor. 
later become the mp uh, in british house of common on behalf of liberal party okay so to champion for the entry of indian into imperial judiciary that is wrong thus 25th question answer is and the next one thing is if you to facilitate discussion of the independence india's independence is highly ruled out right no way discussing to agitate the entry of eminent indian in the british parliament that's what not at all so probable answer to this uh, is this 25 to agitate indian political reform right in the house of what kind of political reforms na more executive members more legislative members to be had that kind question number 26 answer the following statement the most effective contribution made by dada bhai nauru ji to the cause of indian national movement was expose the economic exploitation of india by british poverty and unbritish rule the book interpreted the ancient indian text and restored the self confidence these were the work of arya samajist arya samajist and theosophical society so now we dada bhai nauru ji involved stressed the need for eradication of all the social evil before anything he did but this was not he did it for the welfare of zoroastrian people but never insisted for this right that's why answer is a 26 question 27 who of the following was were economic critic of colonial dada bhai nauru ji poverty and british rule r uh, ramesh chandra dat the economic history of india g subramani ayer in his newspaper the hindu along with that mg ranade all criticized of colonial economic critic of colonialism in india thus uh, answer is d in this it's there in world and said the book 12th and said the book unit number 3 or 4 as such it's there next consider the following statement the first two men president of indian national congress was sarojin naidu it's wrong in 1917 it was anibasan 1917 what's the thing first indian woman president of was uh, president of indian national congress was sarojin naidu in 1925 session thus so carefully look at that and here uh, ani basan 1970 so this statement wrong first muslim president of indian national congress was badruddin diab ji 1888 uh, in madras session first session dada bhai nauru ji wc banerji bombay second session dada bhai nauru ji kolkata third session of inc was held there third session of inc was held there uh, muslim president first muslim president badruddin diab ji thus first statement wrong second statement right answer b bombay economically which of the following which, which, uh, economically one of the fall one of the results of the british rule in india in the 19th century if you carefully look at that there again and again second half of 18th century uh, 19th century first half of 19th century So 19th century is starting is 1800 onwards. So always keep industrial revolution was started in 1760s 1800 in Britain not that much, but 1800 onwards when industrialization re- reached into next phase in Britain and other country, Indian industry started to decline. India started to export raw material, so destruction of India handicraft industries 1800s onwards. increase in the export of indian handicraft no started to decline growth in the number of indian owned factory no absolutely wrong rapid increase of urban population no because of this decline of industrialization uh, handicraft industry ruralization happen not urbanization because of this not increase increase of rural population thus commercialization of agriculture is the answer this is one method of elimination process what is commercialization cultivation of cash crops instead of food crops cotton jute these things so that british can easily export it to the industrialized uh, uh, britain 
indigo cultivation in india declined in the beginning of 20th century yes 1800 and even 18 up to 1900 indigo was in high demand throughout indian indigo was high demand throughout the world but 1900 what happened is german synthetic indigo was invented that led to cheap and the best that's the reason if you look at that that it it's un profitable in the world market because of new invention the new invention is that synthetic german indigo that's a cause present resistant to the oppressive conduct that all just government control over the plant right the planters that's wrong thus 30th question and said this actually this is the main cause of champaran main cause of champaran satyagraha in 1917 That's question number thirty. Answer B. Bombay. Next, come to thirty-one. The partition of Bengal made by lasted until Kasan lasted until King George abrogated the Kasan Act in the Royal Darbar. This is very important. Yeah, Royal Darbar was held. King George was coronated. Right, lot of Darbar. One is Allahabad Darbar, where. Queen's proclamation was made. Here, Royal Darbar, where King George coronated. One of the thing is abrogation of partition of Bengal, but at the same time, in the Royal Darbar only, British intention to change the capital from Calcutta, from Calcutta to Delhi. It's very easy. First World War, uh, when Indian troops were needed. First World War, much later. So definitely, uh, in 1914, that was not Gandhi's last. Launched the civil disobedience movement in 1930. That's wrong. Partition of India absolutely wrong. So thus answer B. Just to go with the elimination method. If you carefully, patiently read the things, you will come to know. Don't go with hasty, nasty measure. Which of the following move? movements has contributed to the split in the indian national congress result in the emergence of moderate and extremist simplest thing so they simon quit india one on common these are all highly irrelevant of this these are all related to a gandhian phase before gandhian phase only viable is this that's why so they simon why is in 1905 related after partition the two tendencies we need swaraj moderate supposed extremist one Second thing is whether the Swadeshi movement to be extended to rest of India or confined to this. That's why within Congress you can see the two clear cut stream. Some people want gradual, some people want extreme. That's why the people are called extremists. Thus, thirty-two ultimata that led to the Suraj split. What was the main reason for the split? In the Indian National Congress at Surat, introduction of communalism in Indian politics by Lord Minto. No, that is 1909, and the partition of Bengal as well as 1909, separate electorate system for the Muslims. That was not extremist lack of faith in the capacity of moderates to negotiate with the British rule. This is considered right. Foundation of Muslim League 1906. That was no way related. That's different. Arvind Gos inability to elect as the president of not Arvind Gos inability. It is the uh, B J Tilak inability to elect. Actually, what led to the session should have been held at uh, not Surat. It should have been held at Nagpur. It was previously originally conceived to be held at Nagpur. So uh, B J Tilak decided to contest, but uh, moderate Sapri hundred, Farooshah group of moderate Sapri hundred. If BJ Tila comes problem, that's why what happened is they deliberately shifted the uh, Nagpur session into Surat session. Surat is located in Bombay province. Automatically, BJ Tila cannot contest because there was a rule that a yeah, presidential candidate should not come from the same province. Thus, the optimal answer is thirty-three B. The Sudeshi and boycott were adopted as method of struggle for the first time during the again one of the easiest thing is it's a agitation right against the partition of Bengal because Sudeshi 
by card passive resistance these were the words of extremist group within the congress i think no need of explanation about this it's a very famous visit right with reference to swadeshi movement consider as following it will contribute to the revival of indigenous artisans craft and industries yes that's what swadeshi swadeshi means local charka popularization of chakka right indigenous artisan crafts and industries yes national council for education was established as a part of this this national commission was established by education sadish chandra mugarji please note down this 35 it was established by sadish chandra mugarji at calcutta thus both the statements are right and one more thing they may ask along with sudeshi movement is atma shakti as atma shakti as emphasized by rabindranath tagore this can be asked as a potential question and 36 with reference to the book desher kada one of the rarest of every year there will be one rarest of rare question no need to bother about this right because if you don't have anything about the question if you couldn't understand the question uh, how could you go for answer first you have to decode the question then only you can come so this is a first even if you couldn't understand the question don't take a risk okay, at least you first understand question then choice then you take in risk in that if you don't understand question i have never come across this no please don't go by just uh, 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 it's a choice that's absolute long right everything correct it want against the colonial state hypnotic conquest of the mind yes hastinastic conquest of mind exactly right right this inspired the performance of sudeshi first time sudeshi street play folk songs right it's a very important even during sudeshi movement this was because the book was published in 1905 1905 within one year nearly 10000 plus copies were sold and it played a vital role uh, in the case of sudeshi movement inspiration during sudeshi movement second statement is also right third statement the use of desh by divskar was in the specific context of the regional of desh no here he says entire nation not specific context of the bengal alone in that sense desh actually i think here after only the word is started to use this statement is wrong actually he is a very important person he was a close this person uh, uh, ganesh divskar was close alaya farvind ghosh thus one is right two is right third statement is wrong answer answer is 1 and 2 36 is right next third is seven with reference to the british colonial rule in india consider the following statement mahatma gandhi was instrumental in abolition of the indentured labor yes because lot of uh, uh, himself witnessed in south africa that's why he was highly instrumental in abolition of the things worked hard for that with the government lord chemcost war conference mahatma gandhi didn't support actually during first world war every indian supported moderate extremist gandhi and every indian supported the british war because in return british would definitely give swaraj but wasted rather than giving swaraj they gave raul attack so this statement is wrong consequently a breaking up of the salt salt law cdm civil disobedient movement the indian national congress was declared illegal 1931 or 32 it was declared as illegal this statement is right because of popular support second statement is wrong thus one and three are right answer is b come to question number 38 consider the following statement regarding any percent right please add regarding any percent consider the following statement response was starting home rule man yes founder of the theosophical society wrong so this is what the thing tricky founder was h b blavatsky henry alcott so it's wrong once a president of indian national congress yes first woman president so 
one is right three is right but not others uh, second 38 answer c next come to 39 in 1920 which of the following changed its name to swaraj sabha uh, all india home rule that's a beauty when all india home rule was started by ani vasan gandhi didn't uh, actually participate but later when raulat satyagraha was started gandhi ji highly utilized the all india home rule movement activities and uh, included them into the raulat and later gandhi himself became the uh, uh, became the president of all india home rule after that in 1920 he changed it into swaraj sabha actually this is what initially he didn't participate during ani vasan but later he actively used such a people volunteers in home rule uh, uh, raulat satyagraha later himself president of delhi later changed the name hindu mahasabha 1950 by Ma, pandit madan mohan malviya south indian liberal federation famously called justice party justice party 1970 uh, na it was started servants of india society by gk gogle in 1905 thus answer is 39 answer is a All India Home Rule Society, uh, Home Rule League. Next part, which of the following is are the principal features of Government of India Act? Introduction of diarchy in executive government. Yes, that's what uh, uh, transferred list, reserved list. Introduction of separate communal electorate for Muslim. Absolutely wrong because of 1909 Act. Devolution of legislative authority by the center to that. so devolution don't confuse with division of power the division of power of federal list residual list concurrent list 1935 act so some devolution was given this is right so don't confuse with division of power if question is of division of power of federal list province list concurrent list it's 1935 act thus except to all are right again answer is 1 and 3 come to question number 41 the government of india clearly defined separation of power between judiciary and executive legislature no no that was much before uh, uh, regulating act pits in the act that itself he little not so not this act the jurisdiction of center and provincial yes government that was given power of secretary state for india and viceroy no power of secretary state and viceroy uh, 19 is uh, 1858 government of india act and none of the above is also wrong uh, answer is this 41 jurisdiction of the center and the provincial government next montek chemsford proposal it's a very easiest to question constitutional reform that led to the montek chemsford reform i think uh, no need of explanation for this question and in the context of indian history the principle of diarchy refers to actually it's a open ended but if you look at the four choice you have to choose the best introduction of double government central and state no that is not diarchy no where we discuss having two seats one in another in delhi no indexna double government uh, division of central legislature into two this is bicameralism this is not diarchy bicameralism this is wrong this is also wrong so division of subject delegated to, to the provincialist into two yes that's what we discussed no? transfer list and uh, diarchy is this so here once is a question same if you look at that the question in one more year previous year they, they just like history wise it's a pure static yeah. only same set of thing but the question and the word formations are different so no need to confuse with these things 43 next come to 44 what was the reason for mahatma gandhi to organize satyagraha on behalf of peasants in kheda the administration didn't suspend the land revenue collection in spite of drought yes you know 1918 failure of monsoon Failure of crops, rightwari losses, tax exemption, if the drought, but administration refused to suspend. That's why Kerala Satyagraha, 
Vallabhai Patel actively participated. These are all other information. The administration proposed to introduce permanent system. That's just a blah, 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 blah statement. Nothing beyond that. So second statement is wrong. The answer is A. Nowhere after Bengal, it was completely frozen. Mahatma Gandhi said that some of his deepest convictions were reflected in a book titled Unto This Last. Actually, this book was written by Rushkin Bond. Rushkin Bond. And one more book, do you know, War and Peace, Leo Tolstoy, that also influenced Unto This. In that, what is the thing is, the good answer is, the good of individual is contained in all good of all. So everyone has, if I have good means, you also have. Good of individual is contained in the good of all. This is what? This is one of the um, toughest questions. Definitely, if you don't understand unto death, unto this last, no need to attend this. So one or two questions in every sub uh, question paper will be tough. If you couldn't understand the question, don't go to answer. Then definitely it will be wrong. Right? And another, you are not going to answer 100 out of 100 questions. Minimum, maximum, 70 to 80 or 75 to 80. So try to avoid the things because these kinds of questions will definitely go wrong if you touch it out of your interest. Forty-six. Which of the following is a very significant aspect of Champaran Satyagraha? Active All India participation of lawyers, student. All India participation of lawyers. How was it? Champaran was regional specific. Active participation. It's very easy. So you can easily eliminate if you carefully look into that statement itself. Actually, this is related to non-cooperation movement. The lawyers boycott. Uh, Lucrative job, many came out. So, first two wrong. Second, active involvement of Dalit and tribal community in national. How is it? It's a present issue. How could the uh, tribes and the uh, Dalit will come? Joining of present movement. Okay, it is right. Well, let us be that. Drastic decrease in the cultivation of plantation crop and commercial. This can be done, but it is a very general thing. So, specific. So, try to eliminate, okay, this will not be there, this will be there. Then, if this and this, which is the best choice? Choose it. This is a method of this. You can use, always be careful, this is right, this is wrong. There itself, you just do the work and come to conclusion. The Raul attack aimed at, popularly known as Anarchy and the Revolutionary Crimes Act. Am I right? Raul attack aimed as imprisonment without trial and summary procedure. It's one of the easiest questions. Compulsory economic suppression of Khilafat movement 1919. After the Raul attack only this happened. Imposition restriction of freedom of press. No way related. Actually, this Raul attack is the extension of Defense. Defense India Act uh, 1915. Thus, answer is uh, B, Bombay. 48. With reference to Raul attack, which of the following statement? The Raul attack was based on the recommendation of Sedition Committee. Actually, this Sedition Committee was set up in 1980. Who was the head of the commission? Uh, committee was Sidney Raul attack. A judge, a session court judge. Uh, later become the vice Rice law member. So, he introduced it. This is what the sedition committee. Do you know whenever uh, preventive detention right now, a commission committee will be set up, juries. First, they have to tell. If once they told, inquiry committee will be held. Once they told, that's all. Even today also, the preventive detention. UPA also, you can see selection committee. One inquiry committee is there. If the inquiry committee consider, yes, put in a, then no appeal, nothing. There is no uh, trial for some years. In Raulat Satyagraha, Gandhiji tried to utilize the home rule. Yes, correct. This is also correct. 
demonstration against narewala simon commission coins it simon commission is 1927 28 rahul attack 1919 absolutely wrong thus you can easily eliminate b c and d can be eliminated again if you know one statement automatic come under in that one or two here is answer b bombay this is also one method if you know one thing is wrong immediately come to the answer what is related okay eliminate then it's a method yeah so always you keep on mind two hours is much important for us never waste of thinking like this 49 during indian freedom struggle national social conference was formed what was the reason for its different social reform group organization in bengal actually this is wrong because this organization was started maximum by mg ranade uh, bombay group not bengal group indian national congress didn't want to include social reform in its deliberation and decided to form separate body yes because keep it in mind initially inc wanted to discuss only the political activity and he don't want to discuss social that's why till the arrival of gandhi inc no way involved in social activity why if involved in social activity different kind of people are there orthodox people liberal people all are there in 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 inc then that is not good that's why he deliberately keep it in mind in inc platform you can't do political social activity but as an individual you can do it but not inc platform next so this is right bm malabari mg ranade to bring to the all social reform group no none of the statement is also wrong thus answer is b next which of the following parties were established peasants and workers party at the time of independence 1947 by tulsidas jadev tulsidas jadev kesavar of jadev tulsidas jadev kesavar of jadev these people started so not ambedkar all india schedule caste federation correct an independent labor party yes this only now called as republic party of india thus one is wrong two and three are right even with reference to congress socialist party consider the following statement first you should know the origin of the congress socialist party it was started in uh, 1934 it was started in 1934 after the quick uh, civil disobedience movement this comes by jay prakash narayan achyut patwardhan acharya narendra dev this was started this concept was started in uh, jail when the people were in nasik jail at that time the concept was started why not to make a socialism within the congress that's why this congress party is congress socialist within congress party nothing outside nothing against congress that's a first keep it in mind with this let us investigate what the con- idea of congress mean to make that so- congress more into socialism more into marxianism more into gandhianism right it like don't confuse with communism if communism means wanted to establish dictatorship of proletariat the automatically this statement is ruled out this is communist that's a major difference between socialism and communist so automatically a and c ruled out then straight away you can come to it advocated separate electorate some minorities for no one would advocate separate electorate system at that so this is the way actually i also don't know exactly of this but by using your prayer knowledge don't panic first and foremost thing in the case of upsc don't panic me be mr cool you will get so automatic advocated by cut of british no automatically answer is d d is the answer come to 52 trade dispute act there are two act one is trade union act 18 1926 which protect the trade union from legal strike but two years later government changed mindset it brought trade dispute bill against that only bhagat singh badikeshwar that through bomb later the trade dispute bill became act 
that is trade dispute act why to set up tribunals and ban on strike if trade union related matter the matter will go to that tribunal tribunal consist of quasi judicial body and that is final and wanted to rest much on the things that's why bhagat singh and padikeshwar that threw bomb against it next 53 with reference to period of indian freedom struggle which of the following was recommended by nehru report complete independence definitely not this is a first negative against the nehru report against the complete uh, independence it asked for swaraj not uh, uh, purna swaraj complete independence for india wrong joint electorates for reservation of seats of minority yes not separate electorate system here is a joint electorate system accepted provision of fundamental rights for the people of india in, in constitution yes actually it is a first document which provide about the fundamental rights 19 fundamental rights are enumerated the second and third statement are right answer is b 2 and 3 next lagor session of indian national congress is important congress passed a resolution demanding complete purna swaraj the rift between extremist moderates were solved this is lucknow session 1916 ruled out so with the second statement whether you could answer this means no which of the following is right now this is wrong this is right so this is ruled out next you have to come a resolution was passed rejecting two nation theory no keep it in mind two in two nation theory was not at all originated in 1929 two nation theory is 1930s with third itself you can easily manage it why not even two nation theory only 1940 lagor session of muslim league so just apply the logic you will come to know the answer is only one that is a a is the answer 55 the people of india agitated against the arrival of simon commission because india never wanted the review of working of 1980 actually as per the 1919 act only the simon commission because the act itself said that at the end of 10 year a commission would be set up but what happened simon commission was established 2 years before itself why 2 years before because the ruling conservative party in 1927 feared that we will be defeated in the subsequent elections that is a reason in a hari bari mode they start up that commission 2 years before actually the commission simon commission should have been established only in 1929 but was started in 1927 itself because of this though it's related but not simon commission recommended abolition of diarchy in the province not because of this is one of the recommendation of the simon commission but this was not the reason or cause of simon commission or uh, agitation there was no indian representative yes if you look at that 1 plus 6 simon and 6 member all are british mp's when it was asked before before lord brickenhead he told that indian cannot become the member that's what the reason suggested partition of the country and those time there is no such a concept regarding partition of the country thus answer c next 56 1929 indian national congress yes indian national congress is significant what is the reason attainment of self government was declared as subject no attainment of purna swaraj already we discussed non cooperation movement 1920 no way related to that decision to participate in round table conference that is a karachi session karachi session 1931 so answer 56 is b bombay 57 who among the following organized a march on tanjore coast coast to break the salt law actually from trichy from trichy to vedaranyam 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 is located near tanjore tanjore coastal region by c rajagopalachari ani pasand was no way k kamraj not B. V. Chidambaram Pillai. By the time 1930s died, the C. Rajagopalachari. Next, Gandhi Irwin Pact. 
invitation of congress to participate round table conference second round table conference yes withdrawal of ordinance promulgated in connection with that yes accept and the gandhi ji suggestion for police access actually gandhi ji requested but british refused release of only those prisoner who are not charged with violence correct the answer is 1 2 and 4 answer is b but uh, 2020 also this was the question but uh, this was highly criticized of that upsc actually uh, uh, upsc didn't give answer about this 2020 or 21 they not charged with violence actually this is the controversial some says gandhi ji uh, talk to them also some says no that's why upsc didn't give answer to this mahatma gandhi undertook fast unto that in 1932 mainly because round table conference failed to satisfy indian political wrong congress and muslim league had different opinion ramse mcdonald around communal award what is communal award separate electorate system to the depressed class people that is called communal award that is the main reason against that he went for uh, fasting unto death in the pune arvada jail after that negotiation with the indian leader like ambedkar that led to that led to the pune pact next question number 60 the distribution of power between center and state as per which act is 19 uh, 35 act what's the distribution of power is the federalist provincialist uh, concurrent list another is residual list these three list concept right among that the residual list with the uh, governor general that is viceroy remaining the same setup what we do have in the name of division of power right don't confuse with the devolution of power earlier in one question we discussed devolution of power 1919 distribution of power as of now we do have division of power date back to 1935 act that's question number 60 answer t question number 61 congress ministry resigned in seven provinces in 1939 because congress couldn't form ministry in other four wrong emergence of left wing in congress made working impossible no there were widespread communal disturbances no so answer is this then why did they mean lord linlitho lord linlitho forced the indian entered into second world war without any opinion without negotiation at least in the case of first world war uh, charles hardinge that is called hardinge 2 famously called hardinge 2 at least suggested and discussed with the indian leader and successfully persuaded the indian leader right to join in the first world war that's why india actively supported in the first world war but not in the case of second world war because linlitho never informed anything to the indian even never discussed against the irresponsible nature of the government that led to the resignation of the congress ministry in all the seven provinces 62 which of the following observation is not true a little controversial question is it was non violent movement na how could you say right actually according to me what's the answer given is this was generally accepted it didn't attract the labor class labor class highly participated it was non violent movement we can't say it's a violent led by gandhi gandhi on the day started but immediately he was arrested spontaneous movement at least this can be eliminated right even uh, let me put on hold about the right actually reasonable answer is given even in you and other sources are like this but uh, i i as personally differ from this how could you say it was a non violence movement the most violent gandhian movement 2022 it is a optional question itself right according to me this is not correct this was led by gandhi do and the gwalia tank speech gandhi personally gave it but we can't say it's led by right i little bit this far and question number 63 in the federation establishment by the government 
residual uh, that's not the discussion uh, residual power with the governor general already we, i discussed this in question number 60 itself next come to 64 with reference with reference to indian freedom struggle usha mehta is known for secret because male lead members were arrested that's why women participated and leadership usha mehta aruna vasafali suchita gribrani kamala nehru sarojini naidu these women actually participated and leadership among that usha mehta set up secret radio station where frequently ramana gurlohia and jay prakash narayan such a revolutionaries during quit india movement gave speech and they uh, uh, they they supported the person gave leadership quality next 65 is the quit india movement was launched in response to cabinet cabinet mission 1946 after general election in britain clementedly sent crips proposal correct 1942 that is right simon commission report 1927 Absolutely wrong. Wavell Plan, 1945. Quit India Movement, 1942. The answer is B. Bombay. Next, 66. With reference to Indian, with reference to Indian freedom struggle, consider the following. Mutiny. Mutiny of Royal Indian Navy, 1946. Pub, 1946. Quit India Movement, 1942. Round table conference, nineteen thirty-one. Answer three, two, one. This is the answer. So better to write the year so that it's very easy and accordingly you can easily manage it. And easily uh, you can you will not get any problem with this. With reference to cabinet mission, which of the following statement is or are right? It recommended the federal. Yes, the mission itself said. there shall be federal government right residual power with the provinces actually one of the main aim of cabinet mission want to avoid partition it proposed federal provincial setup but it failed because uh, when no pakistan provision uh, muslim league started violence it enlarged the powers of indian got no way it touched it provided more indian in that ics no that's a lee commission likewise not the thing of cabinet mission thus answer 67 a next radcliffe committee was appointed to solve the problem of minority no delimits the boundaries between india and pakistan that's why it is uh, full name is cyril cyril radcliffe that's why india pakistan border is called radcliffe radcliffe line next who among the following were the founders of hindu masdur sabha established in 1948 the answer is this in 1948 after independence some of the socialist consider that we need a alternate organization to aitc and intuc because aitc all india trade union con- con- uh, congress a trade union of communists INTUC Indian National Trade Union Congress it is the trade union trade union of congress since both are politically some socialist trade unionist wanted to set up non political independent organization that's what this ashok mehta ramanujam ji ji mehta right they started masdur hindu masdur sabha at haura Howra in 1969. That is the purpose. With reference to land reforms in India, which of the following statements are correct? The ceiling was where they are aimed at family holding and not individual holding. Actually, both individual holding as well as family holding. So, first statement wrong. The major aim of land reform was providing agriculture to all. Yes, that's the main aim. First, foremost aim. it resulted in cultivation of cash crops as predominant form of cultivation no actually keep it in mind if you want to have cultivation of cash crops you need land consolidation not land fragmentation land reform land ceiling led to the land fragmentation for example go to estate mountain huge land then only you can go for cash crops in small lands cash crops are not at all viable 
method. So this is wrong. Land reform permitted no exemption to land sealing. No. This is all related to normal, some exception. If it is a forest land, if it is a land in hill, barren land, land uh, uh, sealing exemptions are exempted. Okay, so there is no hard and fast of land sealing to all. Some of the lands are keep kept allowed to keep beyond land sealing limit. 71. In the first two quarter of 17th century, so question is very specific. First quarter of 17th century, 1600 means 1625. So always, always have the AD, BC, first quarter, second quarter, fourth quarter, likewise you will get. What were that? Broach. Broach means Surat. Yes. Chikakale. Chikakale means here Srikakulam. Srikakulam in, in these are all Anglicized word. Right. Uh, Srikakulam. Surat Broach. Chikakale Srikakulam was not at all. Trignopoli. Trignopoli. Tricharagoli. Tricharagoli was not at all the British settlement. The answer is yeah. With reference to uh, Reference to Madanapalli, Madanapalli of Andhra Pradesh, which of the following statements are right? Pingalavangaya designed the tricolor Indian national flag here, that is in Vijayawada, uh, not in Madanapalli, that is wrong. Patabi Shitrame let quit India movement? No. Before that, he was arrested. So, right answer is this. When he was stay staying at uh, in Madanapalli, Theosophical College was there. When he was staying at the college, he composed that, which of the following statement, right? In the from Bengali to English, why not? Here only the Janaganamana was actually entered into tune. Earlier it was just a slogan or really. From that it's made as a song, not only translation from, uh, from Bengali to English. Here only it was made as a tuning concept. Who tuned was Margaret Cousin, the wife of uh, Theosophical College principal. Madam Blavatsky and Colonel set up headquarters here, that is in Adaya. So this is absolutely ruled out. Maximum thing is among the three, here you can eliminate this problem with related to this. So answer is C. 73, Saint Francis Xavier was one of the founder of Jesuit order along with Ignatius, Ignatius, Ignatius of Loyola in his 1530s. It's a counter reformist order. So it is right. Saint Francis Xavier died in Goa. No. He died in China at the age of 40, 46, 47. So this is wrong. The feast of Saint Francis Xavier is celebrated each year, December. December 3, uh, he died in his death date. That's why answer is uh, C, because it, uh, the date is very important. It's celebrated all over the world. That's why this is important. So 73 answer C. Next, 74. Montek Chimsford reform recommended grant of voting rights to all the women, so uh, universal adult suffrage was not even given to the male member. How about the women? So it's wrong. The first time women was given voting rights in 1919, but not all to the women based on limited franchise. So first two statements. So these kinds all only, please be careful. Second, the government of India gave women reservation seats in legislature. Yes, first is voting rights. Here is reservation in seating. That's why second statement alone is right. Next, to come to question number 75 with reference to uh, August 8 in India, which of the following? Quit India resolution was adopted by AACC, AACC in Congress. In the same, only Gowalia tank speech. Right, Gowalia tank speech, do or die slogan, these things. The Viceroy's Executive Council was expanded to include, this is Lin Litho's statement, August offer. Option B is related. 
Congress Ministry resigned on December 1939. So that is 1939, not related to the Scripps proposal, March month, not August. After the uh, after that uh, failure of Scripps, he started with India. So answer is A. 76. Who among the following is associated with song from Krishna? A translation of Indian Indian religion, ancient, ancient Indian religious lyric in English, M.K. Gandhi. When he was in jail during uh, civil disobedience, uh, Yaravada jail, he composed it, especially from Ubanisad. Seventy-seven. Who among the following was associated to secretary with the Hindu fem female school, which later came to name Bethun Female School, Ishwar Chandra Vidyasagar, now located in Calcutta. Now it is a uh, Bethun College. Bethun College. It's a well-known thing. Any person theosophical say Banaras Hindu University. Devendra Tagur, Tattva Badri Patrika, Sarojin Naidu Nove. Kandian related to uh, the political upliftment. So, no way related to this. Next, in this context of colonial, Shana Vaskan, Prem Kumar Shekal, Guru Bak Singh Dillan were remembered as leaders of Sudeshi movement. No. At that time, were they born or not questionable? <laughs> Just joking. Right. A number of in members of interim government. No. Uh, he would have studied. Member of drafting committee, because we have not come across it. Officer of Indian National Army, INA. Actually, they are associated with the uh, INA trial. INA trial, which was held in Redford, started on November, November 1946. Because on behalf of all the soldiers, these three leaders were put under trial. So, officers of Indian National Army. With the reference to Indian history, which of the following statement are right? Nizamad of Hyder emerged out of Hyderabad state. Yes, that is right. Already discussed this matter. Because Hyderabad was this much big. From that later here, present day Tamil Nadu, where you can see Arkada was emerged. That is right. Mysore Kingdom emerged out of Vijayanagar. Yes. After Battle of Talikota, general disintegration of Vijayanagar Empire, Mysore governor. Uh, Krishna, Chikka, Krishna Rajendra Vadayar founded this kingdom. Rohilkand kingdom was found out of our territory occupied by Ahmad Shah Durani. That is Ahmad Shah Abdali. No, this is wrong. Though Ahmad Shah Durani, uh, even he didn't carve out the, uh, any territory because Ahmad Shah Durani's aim was only to plunder. In that sense, and this is wrong. The answer, answer is one and, uh, one and two only. Next, come to question number 80. Consider the following. 21st Feb is declared to be international. Yes. Mother tongue, that is right. Not by UNICEF, by UNESCO. That's why it's a small thing. It's a day, so on, so on. So UNICEF is, it's a fund, am I right? So here UNESCO. The demand that Bangla has to be one of the national language was raised in constant assembly. Yes, when constant assembly of Pakistan at Karachi, there was a debate why an assembly member must speak only either in Urdu or in English. But what happened? Many East Bengal, Pakistan people opposed in the Constituent Assembly at Karachi. Later, what deliberately Pakistan did it, made Urdu as the national language of Pakistan. That led to the resentment in East Pakistan region. Actually, on the day is celebrated as that international day that started in Constituent Assembly. Keep it in mind. Because of Bangladesh High Commission, Permanent Commission in UNESCO, UN requested that. That's why every year is being celebrated. 21st Feb is celebrated as International Mother Language Day. In the Government of India, yes, 1919 function of research transfer subject, which of the following treated? Actually, this is related to diarchy system in province. For example, that the provincialist, provincialist was divided into two. One is the transferred list, reserved list. Actually, both the list under the control of governor, but with the help of whom he manages the matter. In the case of reserved list, governor with the members nominated by him. Reserved list are powerful list. 
land order, revenue, powerful list. Dummy list also, the transfer list are called dummy list, governor with the ministers selected by or sent by PLA, that is people representative. Water, local self-government, medicine, uh, education, these are all in transfer. That's why administration of justice, land revenue, police, these are all under reserved list. So reserved list are powerful list. Come to 82. Barindar Kumar Ghosh, Jogesh Chandra Jataji, Raj Bihari Bose, who are associated with Gadar Party, is only this. Raj Bihari Bose, though was in Japan, Gadar Party in USA, he was associated because Gadar Party member, not only in San Francisco, they have the active membership uh, in, in Singapore, Japan also. Right After uh, the Delhi bomb blast, Raj Bihari Bose escaped to Japan, where he became the member of the Gadar Party. Barindra Kumar goes, Jogesh Chandra Jataji are related to Anushilan Samiti. Anushilan Samiti of uh, Kolkata group. That's why answer D. 83. With reference to Crips proposal, Constituent Assembly would have member nominated by Provincial Assembly. It is wrong. Elected. In that sense, it is wrong. So, Provincial Assembly would send as well as Princely State also. Actually, Princely State would nominate. Provincial as Legislative Assembly would elect. It's like a Rajya Sabha election. That's one answer uh, wrong. Second, any province which not uh, prepared to accept any constitution would have the right to sign separate agreement with Britain regarding future state. And actually, this is the indirect provision of setting up a separate country. With reference to Indian history, who among the following were named Kula Dharan? Yes. Arab merchants, no. Arab merchants are called Moors. Kalandar. Kalandars related to Sufism. Uh, Sufism, no. Kalandars are related to uh, the wandering Darvish. That is uh, Sanyasi. Islamic Sanyasis. Right. Wandering Darvish. Darvish are called Kalandar. Or Fakir. Persian calligraphy. Persian calligraphy was not Kuladharan. Sayyid brothers are called Kuladharan. Actually, if you go to uh, in, in Islam, Sayyid, Ahmad, Turani, Quran, likewise, theologians, different. Each will have identity. For example, some group will have turban. Some group will have pointed cap. Pointed means like a cricket player used to. Uh, turban means like sick, uh, sick piece to say. So, uh, such a kula, kula na kula, pointed cap. So, you can easily identify with the pointed cap that's here, kula dharan, the Sayyid brothers. Right, not Sayyid brothers, Sayyid, all the Sayyid. Because Sayyid, one more thing is, Sayyid were considered to be the descendant of Prophet Muhammad. That's why they are related to Fatima, one of the daughter of uh, Prophet Muhammad. That's the reason Sayyid are being treated good, especially during in, in Islamic world. Even the great uh, marauders, Amir Taimur, didn't attack, didn't persecute the Sayyid. This is another information. The Dutch established their factory warehouse on the east coast of land granted to them by Gajabadis. Not Gajabadis, here is Bahimini. Even though Gajabadis were ruling, Little North, the Kanjam district here in Orissa, uh, immediately below that, Bahimini's Golconda. That so first statement wrong. Alfonso de Albuquerque captured from Bijapur ruler. It's a very famous in 1510. The first uh, Indian settlement occupied by a uh, European after Alexander the Great. English near company established a factory at Madras on the plot of land leased from representative of Vijayanagar. Yes. Representative of Vijayanagar is Raja of Chandragiri. Chandragiri, from that only they got a land, the present fact called Madras, St. George Fort. Answer is B. Thus, this is the common thing is don't panic, first of all. Second thing is read the question. After reading the question, carefully read the choice. 
all only alone nomination these kinds of words underlined it these are all check for example in environment you take this species is available in entire uh, northern hemisphere if question is asked entire northern hemisphere that considered to be that okay this is a only species endangered species in india how could only one that kind of statement please double check it one sec next thing if you consider if a statement is wrong damn sure na straight away come to the choice you can eliminate two to three choice because no need to read other immediately you can come to an conclusion anyhow you you study other choices also other statements also okay so this is a way because you have limited period in the case of preliminary exams right so this is a trick of this so no need to panic carefully listen not necessarily all the question and answer to be known with what do you know go for elimination method right even the two pairs third pair is there elimination method still survive especially statement based even pair based question also if you don't know exact answer please don't touch it and if you don't know the question itself don't touch it okay first thing you should understand question second you should know at least all the four choice then only you have to come to which is the right choice if you could in understand or come across about the question better to leave such a question don't take it's it's like a pinky punky method this is absolutely wrong this will drag your feet all the best Thank you.